Good afternoon folks, this is Ollie from Roman Motor Company. We got our beautiful 996 right here that's going to be going live on Bring a Trailer in the next couple of days. So as usual, we're going to do a quick walk around, show you guys the car, the interior, um, any modifications I may have, which this only has one, and then a couple of blemishes that it has uh, to make sure you guys understand what you're bidding on. So first we'll do a walk around. The car overall looks in outstanding condition for how old it is. Um, mileage obviously is at 68,000 miles so very, very low miles for a 2001 and it shows interior exterior is in flawless condition uh, we actually did our uh, typical uh, process that we do which is the three-stage paint correction so if you notice once we get a little up close there's pretty much zero swirls on the whole car we also did a um, sealant towards the end of the process so same thing when Zerna sealant as most of our cars um, so the paint's protected it's corrected it's good to go uh, as far as the interior goes we did our uh, steam cleaning process and then the leathery conditioner and whatnot on the seats so overall beautiful condition we're gonna look at a couple of blemishes uh, front end seems to have a lot of rock chips usually this car is actually very very clean there's pretty much no rock chips so we'll take a look at the front end headlights are in amazing condition as well as far as the blemishes go it's kind of this little section right here so if you see right here we got what seems to most probably have been a rock chip it's got a little bit of clear coat failure right there not very obvious to see but when you get up close it's there uh, we got a little ding right here maybe a door ding from a truck or something so there's that and then we got a little scratch right here more like a big scratch um we could have wet sanded this but we kind of kept it original we didn't want to mess too much with the paint so to keep it safe we left it on passenger side seems to be very clean shape no dings no scratches i don't see any which is good um rear end very very clean i don't see any scrapes or anything like that scratches or any kind of imperfection the only problem in the rear end that i've noticed is one little chip right here i don't know if you can see it little rock chip or paint chip another paint chip right here this seems to have been from a garage closing um incident luckily there's no dings on the paint or on the body panels which is good uh tail lights outstanding condition both sides there's the rear bumper and then on the door we got a tiny little chip right here and let's see no minor scratch somewhere there and i think that is about it uh driver's side wheel flawless condition no chips no scratches no scrapes driver's side rear little curb rash right there minor chip minor chip right there can't really see it but it is there as far as the passenger rear goes this one does have some rock chips i believe the chips are more like this section i don't think you can see it but overall this wheel does have quite a bit of curb rash very common because the passenger rear when people parallel park so it's all in this section right there Let's, uh, keep the video on this for a little bit longer so you can see it all right and then we got the uh, passenger side front it seems to be just as good as the opposite the outside very clean no scratches no scrapes just good all right so let's do um, the interior just like the rest of the car interior is in outstanding condition as well driver's side seat passenger we'll go on that side as well center console this is the color match to our uh, painted center console actually um, again flawless condition i was very surprised at how clean that is uh, no scrapes or scratches on that uh, which is awesome and then we got the rear seats um, a little marks on the rear seat right here probably from a baby seat i would assume uh, but the leather and everything is really clean shape not too bad um, dash center console everything again perfect shape if you notice the steering wheel it does have some wear and tear right around the 12 o'clock mark so that's that the head unit has been swapped out with a uh, newer aftermarket head unit which is a alpine unit i've actually used this myself for a couple days very easy to use and it does have apple carplay and everything so makes a big difference on a car like this where usually the stock head unit is not so fun to use and doesn't really have a lot of features um, and luckily it keeps a very original look to it too so it doesn't look too bad um, 
passenger seat again i don't think it's even been used much um, door panel great shape all right we got that let's take a look at the engine bay and let's start it up first Take a look at the uh, front right here. All the panels inside of it. Beautiful. It's got the original spare tire and everything. Um, all these panels are in beautiful condition. Uh, surprisingly, we didn't even do a whole lot to it. Uh, it was actually already in great shape. So let's do a video of the top top of course works like it should and we'll take a look at how perfect the soft top is pretty much brand new no rips tears or anything like that just brand new like the rest of the car pretty much all right there's that we will do a uh, most likely do a driving video point of view um, and post that up along with this video um, I will be on the bidding section or the comment section on bring a trailer as usual very active if you guys have any questions let me know I'll be more than happy to answer them for you if I don't know the answer I'll find out for you all right happy bidding and good luck